all right what up everybody uh welcome back to my channel today we're doing a little bit of a different style of video um for one i'm going to re be recording this way um just because it's easier um to um edit i just got to uh little caesar's um i ordered some yummy yummy food so i'm about to go in and um yeah let's go let's go let's go let's go all righty you guys i just left little caesars god this lighting is terrible uh package secured so i'm gonna go get my car and um see if it's where i want to eat at if not we're gonna go on a little ride <laughs> find a better spot to park so i'll see you in a second you guys i just drove to a whole ass another parking lot because there were so many people in that other one I was like, you know what? You know, oh, I'm gonna pull forward. Block that sun a little bit. That's perfect. Okay, so this looks bomb and I'm super freaking hungry. Okay, let's move my seat back a little bit. So I'm not super close to the, um, to the screen. Okay, so I got some marinara because I mean, everything's good with marinara pizza wise. Okay, I got some crazy. Okay, so I freaking ordered, um, I ordered wings, buffalo wings, and I got there and they didn't have any. So I just got some cheesy bread. I didn't want these, but I wanted to get a side. So I just got those. That's what was hot and ready. And then I got a stuffed crust, oh, stuffed crust uh, meat lovers pizza. So I'm literally just gonna dig in. I'm super stoned right now, if you can't tell. Okay, let's start with, yeah, this is like super nice, it's secluded. <laughs> okay, open up this marinara. And today, my sister told me, I was on, I was texting with her earlier. She's like, what are you gonna talk about today? I'm like, that I don't know. Um, well, let's try this one. This looks hella cheesy. Ooh, that looks good, okay. She's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, I don't know. Hell yeah. It's 5-12 here. This is my first time eating. Oh, I got Dr. Pepper, which I didn't want either. And they didn't give me any napkins. That's all right. This is really good. Okay. So she was like, what are you going to talk about? I don't know. She was talking about that one time in Vegas when you lost your phone. I'm like, that's a good idea. Hang on. Okay. Sorry, I need a big glare coming from a window. That's really good. Of course, I have no napkins. Here we go. Like a little towel. That'll have to do. Okay. I'm getting a piece of pizza. So. Ooh, and we did not cut this. Jesus Christ. Okay, hang on, guys. I'll try to get a piece out. Got it. There we go. I got stuffed crust too, so we'll see how good that is. So, mm -hmm. that's really good. Okay, so the first time I went to Vegas, I've been to Vegas three times. <laughs> the first time was definitely the craziest, like hands down. 
it was the wildest, the wildest um, Vegas trip I've been on. I was 22. My sister and her um, fiance at the time, they were getting married a month later. And we're in the middle of Vegas and wound the fuck out. So fun. But, uh, my sister and her fiance at the time took me to Vegas. We stayed at the Cosmopolitan, which was like, if you've ever been to Vegas, you know that that's like one of the nicest hotels on the Strip. Bomb. Not cheesy enough to pull it. That's okay. Maybe another one. To that marinara home there. Mm. But, um. This is bomb. Need a ton of drink. So, we stayed at the Cosmopolitan. It was so much fun. Right? We went to clubs, I think, almost almost nightly, like almost every night. We were there for, I think, four, four nights. And um, and so one night we went to the club in our uh, hotel room called the Marquee. So fun. They like shoot air at you. So it's like like a windmill when you're dancing. They'll do bubbles, foam, whatever. And girls are free, so like most of the time guys have to pay to get in. Girls normally get in free and they get free drinks from a certain amount of time. But they like tell you like if you get caught giving your drinks to guys, like they'll kick you out. So I'm tearing this up. So, we were there that night. Getting silly, like, <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna get turned up. Because in Vegas, like, bottom shelf alcohol is like top shelf alcohol if you go to any bar in your hometown. You know, so it's like Grey Goose, Belvedere. It's good. It's like good alcohol. Mm. Get this one. So. Dip, 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 dip. We were at this party for a few hours. My sister just got twisted. So they went back to the room. I'm like, I'm ready to party. If anybody knows that me, I'm like, I'm the partier. Like, I love to just have a good time. We have a whole crew is, so. But like, I show up to get the party started. <laughs> this is how it is. It's actually really good. So. They went back to the room. I went back down to the club. Oh my God, I was like partying, dancing my ass off, like drinking, having a good time.
I went to the bathroom and I'm like flicked my hair and stuff like that I reached down into my purse which was like a side clutch like a little side bag hella cute thought I was doing something by keeping the bag close to me you know hmm. I know my ass is not starting to get full see it always happens well I reached down in my little bag thinking I'm gonna buy my phone mind you I've been taking hella pictures hella videos and oh it's bomb you can see that see the um stuff crust in there <laughs> oh man so I reached out to my purse and my phone is not there and it's nowhere to be found or seen. Excuse me. Woo. Jesus. It's nowhere to be found. Instant. I mean, if you guys have ever like lost your phone and you and then you find out that it's lost, it's instant fucking panic. Like fuck backtrack where where did i leave it like you know what i mean that's where i was at i was like fuck i gotta find my phone i'm in the middle of a fucking vegas club the music is hella loud and there are people everywhere so if i dropped on the dance floor it just got fucking stomped to death a nice bouncer like saw that I was like looking for my phone I'm like <laughs> I wasn't crying but I was just like fucking pissed I was just so fucking pissed and I am I'm gonna lock my door I was like, I just lost all my pictures. I lost all my videos and now I don't have a phone to communicate with anybody. I was so angry. But I was like dancing still. I, in the middle of looking, I was like still on the dance floor like looking. The bouncer was like so nice and was trying to like help me find my phone. For like all night. What was there? Mind you, I'm like, you know what? I'm here. I'm in Vegas. Like, I'm going to have a good time tonight, regardless if I can find my phone. But I made a mega time out of it. What are you going to do? I wasn't going to go back up to the room and sulk and pout. I'm like, I'm going to fucking dance. I'm going to drink because I ended up getting free fucking drink tickets for the rest of the night because the girls only drink free to, till like 10 o'clock. 10 or 11 and after that like you have to buy drinks and drink, drinks in vegas forget about it they're so expensive uh, 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 uh. they're like 20 bucks a pop or more okay so he had given me free drink tickets all night i was like well you know what? thank you for that save me some money because i'm gonna have to buy a new phone <laughs> You guys, when I tell you I stayed at this club until 6 a.m., like 6.30 a.m., the sun was up. I was dragging my ass out of the club. I was already at my fucking hotel, so I just had to go up a couple floors, like, and drag myself in my room. I'm like, fucking pissed. I was like, fuck. My sister wakes up as I come in. She's like, hi. She's always so sweet. She's like, hi, baby. You know. How are you? You know. And I'm like, I lost my phone. She's like, oh. You know, I was like, ugh. She knows how I am. Like, I like to document everything. 
it's just always how I've been. I've always been the one to, you know, get pictures of everything and video of everything. I've always just been that person. So it was just like really like a shot to the heart. <laughs> I don't know if anybody else feels that way, but it fucking sucks. So I was like, you know, just let mom know that <laughs> I don't have a phone. I don't have a phone for the rest of the trip. <sighs> called my phone company. Well, I like called. I had to call the, I called the lost and found so many fucking times. God, people keep going in and out of there. I called that lost and found so many fucking times. They were probably like, no, bitch, stop calling. <laughs> what are you going to do? I don't know. I left Vegas without a phone. I had to call and cancel that bitch. So someone couldn't use it. I really thought I was about to put a dent in this. I really thought. Damn. I wanted to eat like five pieces of this. Say right. I got so stoned before this mukbang. And then I went back again to Vegas. I think when I was 24. And then I just went last December for work. But it was like two months before everything shut down. I was up in the sky flying when all the shit was breaking loose. Shit was going crazy down here and we didn't even know it. That's crazy, huh? Well, I am not mad. It's heavy, though. <laughs> Shit is heavy, 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 heavy. I really would like to go back. Honestly, ASAP. I'd love to be able to go for my birthday in August. You know what I mean? Like, you know, Drew's daydream of traveling again. Just get stuck, just, you know, just thinking about when we're gonna be able to like fly places safely again without having to worry so much. Drop down in the comments below where are you gonna go the when you can when we can fly safely again. Where's the first place you wanna go? Where's the first place you wanna travel to? And also if you haven't, please click subscribe. I'm trying to get this channel to at least a thousand um by the end of the month. So please, please, please do me a favor and just hit subscribe. If you guys want to follow me on any of my other channels, um, those links will be in the description box below. Um and as always, please let me know you want what you want to see me eat next. Uh, next week I do have some ideas I think it's going to be between Taco Bell and excuse me and fried shrimp Whew, excuse me so if you could let me know um, in the comments below what you want to see me eat Taco Bell or fried shrimp just like drop an emoji just do me that do me that favor okay okay and hit that subscribe button just hit it it hit just hit it hit it hit it hit it Okay. <laughs> okay. So, uh, next time you guys, I'm going to be posting videos every Wednesday. Um, 
So yeah, you'll see this tomorrow. Um, as always, I love you guys so much and let me know what you want to see, what you want to see uh, me eat next. I'll talk to you soon. Bye guys.